Hello everybody, I'm going to teach you how to make a login page and a registration page via Dreamweaver. Here you have your your database, uh, my PHP, my admin, it's in here, it's already put together. Find out which database you're going to by going localhost up here and then Miracle Register, whatever. Um, then open up your Dreamweaver. You want to open up a regular file. So let's just say we're going to open one up, but I'm not really because I've already got one open. You want to click PHP, blank page, PHP, create. Okay. And then you will open up and you'll have this here. All right. Then you want to connect to a database. Oh, then you want to make a site. Hopefully you've got a site defined because I've got one here. In order to do that, you go in and you create a new site and it will ask you to name it, give you your HTTP, your address to your, um, right here, to your site. Next, I want to use PHP MySQL, so I said yes to user technology. Um, and then this is where you're going to store all of your files locally. And then you have to put in your FTP information. Um, make sure you get it right, because <coughs> this can really screw up trying to get connect to a database. All right. Anyways, we're going to do this, and then the root folder of your site, which is whatever, mine's mysticsite.com. All right. You always test the URLs while you're going through this. And then you're done. And then this will pop up, and it will go, woo, this is your site. And then you want to come over here. See? Connecting to Mystic Site. So it's connected, and all the files you can see are down here, which are none because I've got nothing in there whatsoever but beyond an owl. All right, so we're going to create a database right quick here. Attach it to our database anyway. And MySQL connection, and then you want to put in your name to your, um, your database. And local host. I'm trying something here and there right now. So if this doesn't work, then I'll just do it the old way. But I'm going to try to see what I can do. Alright, press select because you're looking to get into a database right there. And then you want register and then press OK because that's the database that I'm in right here. See? Register. So that's where you want to be. We're doing good. So far, so good. And press OK. And then we want to go to um, actually, yeah, bindings. Let's do bindings real quick. And then it tells you right here what to do. Create the site, document type, blah blah, set up the server site testing. Press the plus button and then a record set because that's what we want. And then the name is going to be registration. And it's register and register is the table. And you got all of this. And you're good. You want to test it real quick. And you can see I've got a couple different things in there right now, but they're just blah blah. Alright, so you have registration and then you want to press OK. And then you want to go up here to insert. Here's the big daddy of them all. And then application objects. I know I've got like menus, D, W, menu insert. I know it mine's extra, but I really don't care. Object record set. Object 
record set, insert record, and then object insert record. So you want to connect Miracle 2 register register. I don't want ID in there, so I don't need that. We're going to rename this. Um, and then we're going to rename this. And because it says L name when it's last name. Um, and then I want to go down to the permissions and get rid of that because I don't really need people like choosing their own permissions. Anyways, so you've got all of this and then you press OK and wait till you see what pops up. It's a registration form. And on the insert record thing, you just press it, go to your properties table, and then press register in there. And it should be all good, as you can see. And then at the top, usually I'll put some, um, what do you call it in here? I hope I can get this damn thing to do anything. Okay, so we're at the body, and we're going to put uh, HTML. Oh, I think we've already got register and that should work let's see what happens let's refresh it and there it is now we're going to upload this to our site okay so we're going to put the files in there yes you want to put the entire site in there Yes, I do want to save it. I forgot to save the file, but it gives you the option to do so. Thank goodness. Okay, so we want to go to right yonder. Let's just go to this one. Plastic site. Hopefully this works. Okay, there it is. <laughs> and then you want to put blah, 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 boo boo, and la la, and gaga, and bra. And oh, I think you need numbers in there. Otherwise, it may not do it. Alright, let's do one 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 and now let's just do this real quick and then we'll just put in George as the password. George and then register. Okay, as you can see I didn't have it go anywhere after it registered. You can do that. So over here, we're going to go to my register table and look again. Oh, look, there's blah, blah, boo, boo, la, la, gaga. So it's in there. It works, okay? So the biggest thing is you want to go into the HTML area up here on the form, and you want it to redirect obviously um, yeah registration but I want it to redirect to another where do I 